twenty. I got to yodel yesterday, and now I'm on zucchini. Oh yeah. Yesterday. If I could travel back in time, I'd visit yesterday to tell myself the things I'd see throughout the coming day. I'd tell me now that then is good, I'd tell me not to fret. Cause although yesterday is fun, tomorrow's better yet. But if I knew what tomorrow was like, perhaps I would get bored. Cause half the fun of living is not knowing what's in store. Dear God, thank you for yesterday and everything I've done. And thank you for tomorrow and for everything to come. What things did you do yesterday? My cousin came over yesterday. I breakfast. Did homework. Go to school. Thank God for being with you then, now, and forever. Yodel. I thought that I'd try something new and yodel out a prayer to you to thank you, God, for all you do. Yodel, 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 yodel. Yodel. If I'm going to do it right, I'll climb up to the mountain heights so I can be right next to you. Yodel, 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 yodel. And when I yodeled out my prayer, I'd listen to hear if you were there and echoing back, I love you too. Yodel, 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 yodel. Nice to know you're listening to prayers I say and prayers I sing. Amen. Ah, Peter saying doodaloo. Yodaloo. Let me hear you yodel. Wow, that's quite a yodel. Open up your throat and yodel a thank you to God. Yawn! <sighs> it's time to snuggle up in bed, to close my eyes and rest my head, to tuck my covers, hug my bear, uh, to fold my hands and say my prayers, to thank the Lord for parents, friends, and all the blessings oh, which God sends, to praise and thank God once again, to bow my head and say amen. Uh, to click the light, to shut the door, to doze, to snooze, to sleep, to snore, to dream of fun things through the night, to wake with a yawn at morning light. Ugh. Why do you think people yawn? Because sometimes they get tired and they want to make a quiet noise because they get tired <sighs> after sleeping. <gasps> Next time you yawn, say thank you to God for yawns. Yes! Does Jesus hear me when I pray? Does Jesus take my sins away? Did Jesus come to set me free? Did Jesus die and rise for me? Will Jesus always be my friend? Will Jesus come to earth again? It's very simple, take a guess. I'll give a hint, the answer's yes. Does Jesus love you? Yes. Yes. Yes, because the Bible tells me so. The answer is yes. Yo, yo. It's up, it's down, it's up again. This yo-yo's fun to take for a spin. Just flick your wrist and give it a throw. Then up and down the yo-yo goes. It's fun to play this simple game. Each time I do it, it's the same. First down, then up, then down it goes. Just up and down is all it knows. 
God did not make me that way. I feel quite different every day. I'm up and down at times, it's true. And lots of other feelings too. And here's some news I know is real. No matter what feelings I feel, God sees and shares each thing I do. My highs and lows and middles too. Dear God, it's really great to know. You pick me up when I feel low. Through all my ups and all my downs, I'm happy, God, that you're around. Some days you might feel happy. And some days you might feel sad. How do you feel right now? I might feel mad. I might feel disappointed. I might feel surprised. I feel happy. Shy. Angry. Happy. God is with you no matter how you feel. How's that make you feel? The letter Y. I thank the Lord for letter Y. It is my favorite, and here's why. It makes the coolest sounds, the greatest sounds around. No matter if it's up or down, the Y is just the best in town. Now you say the letter Y. Say the letter Y In Yam and Yak and you In Yippee and Yahoo When Y's the start of any word The Y sound is the sound you heard There are other ways to say the Y Other ways to say the Y Sometimes it sounds like I Like shy and fly and cry It even sounds like letter E So try and yell it happily that's how you say the letter Y. 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 What words start with the letter Y? You, your, yak, yike, yesterday. Thank God for everything that starts with Y. Yummy! Dear God, I know a word that starts and ends with Y, and in the middle there's an mmm. And here's the reason why. I want to lick my lips and rub my little tummy, because in case you couldn't guess, the word I know is yummy. It's yummy when I say it. It's yummy when I read it. It looks so yummy when I write it. I'm afraid I'll eat it. It makes the yummiest sound that I have ever heard. So thank you, God, for yummy food and also yummy words. What's the yummiest meal you've ever eaten? Macaroni and cheese. Broccoli. Spaghetti. Uh, macaroni and cheese. Mmm, sounds yummy. Thank God for yummy foods. People in the Bible. Yahweh means I am the Lord. That's the name that Moses heard. Simon the Cyrenian carried Jesus' cross for him. Lydia gave to the needy. Eutychus was very sleepy. Timothy was young, it's true. He loved Jesus just like you. These are the words with why I know, for the Bible tells me so. Does your name start with the letter Y? How about your friends? Do you know anyone whose name begins with Y? Yeah.
A yakety yak is brown. A yakety yak is furry. A yakety yak might like to track, but he's never in a hurry. Never in a hurry. A yakety yak is strong. A yakety yak is sturdy. A yakety yak might want to talk back, but he's not very wordy. He's not very wordy. A yakety yak seems strange and more than a little whack. But though it's odd, it was made by God, so let's say thanks for you. What is the noisiest animal you can think of? Elephant. A lion. A monkey. The human. Thank God for every yakety animal. Welcome to another yawningly yummy episode of In the Kitchen with Giuseppe Zucchini. Hello everyone, my name is the Giuseppe Zucchini. As always, I am very happy to invite you into my kitchen for another meal. Why, Giuseppe? Why? That's a good question, Gianni. I guess I just like to show people how to make good food. Not why, Giuseppe. Why? Why is the letter of the day. Get it? <laughs> good one, Gianni. Why is a word, like, why do you always try to eat me? And why is also a letter? Because you're so yummy. Very good. You're and yummy both start with the letter Y. Those are good examples, Gianni. What? I was just answering your question, Giuseppe. I tried to eat you because you're so yummy. Ooh. Well, why don't we move on to some other yummy treats for today's show? What do you have in mind for today? Make it through the show without getting eaten. What's that, Giuseppe? Oh, nothing, Gianni. I was just saying I have some eggs that need to be beaten. Eggs do not start with why. Yes, this is true, but we need to beat the egg yolk. You know what I say, you can't beat a good egg yolk. How many eggs does it take to change a light bulb? No, not an egg joke, Gianni. Egg yolk. That's the yellow part in the middle of an egg. Oh, right. The egg yolk. <laughs> I knew that, Giuseppe. Why do we need an egg yolk? I tell you why, Gianni. Today we are making baked yams. Yams, which also start with Y. Correct. And we will be spreading the yolks on the yams before we bake them to give our yams a crispy, crunchy, yummy top. I like the sound of that, Giuseppe. Let me give those egg yolks a good beating. And while you are doing that, I will be whipping the yams. Eating the eggs? Whipping the yams? These poor Y foods will never know what hit them. Very funny, Gianni. You are just full of jokes today. Better to be filled with jokes than filled with zucchini. Right, Giuseppe? <laughs> right, Gianni. What? Just joking, Giuseppe. Oh, I get it now. I think. But you are scaring me a little. That reminds me of another joke, Giuseppe. Would you like to hear it? Um, yes? Why did the zucchini cross the road? I don't know, Gianni. Why? Because he was a little chicken. <laughs> Get it? A little chicken? Okay, okay, enough jokes, Gianni. Let's uh, say a prayer to thank God for our food. Today we will pray the yummy prayer. Dear God, each time I fill my tummy, I thank you for my food so yummy. Amen. What do we do now, Giuseppe? Now we spread the yolks on top of the yams and bake them in the oven for a while. The yolks will make the yams taste so yummy. I can do that, Giuseppe. Just let me take the yolks and... Don't joke around, Gianni. You don't want to spill the... Yikes! Yolks. Oh, no, Giuseppe. I'm a so sorry. That's okay, Gianni. Just help me get cleaned up. Hey, Giuseppe. I guess you could say the yolk is on you. Yes, very funny. In fact, instead of yams, why don't we just bake a nice, sweet, yolk-covered zucchini? Yoinks! That's all the time we have for today, folks! See you next time! This has been another yearningly yelpable episode of In the Kitchen with Giuseppe Zucchini. 
Tune in next time when Giuseppe says... Yowza! Yellow. Dear God, hello. Thanks for yellow. It's the color that is swello. Chicks and ducklings are that color. So's the sun, and so is butter. Yellow corn and yellow squash. Yellow gourds are good, by gosh. Yellow lemons, yellow apples. Autumn leaves are yellow dappled. And bananas and canaries. Yellow lions sure are hairy. Yellow daffodils and daisies. All things yellow are amazing. Yellow sun on yellow grain. Yellow slickers when it rains. Yellow buses, yellow beaches, all are yellow things, and each is something we can thank God for. Can you think of any more? Name some things that are yellow. Lemon, awabadaki. Thank God for yellow things, and for every color of the rainbow. Yachtsmen. Dear God, when I grow up a lot, I'll be a yachtsman on a yacht and take off with a yo-ho-ho -ho to anywhere I want to go. And with my yeoman next to me, I'd sail up to the Yellow Sea. We'd swim on every sunny day, just like down at the YMCA. I'd journey on for many years to places both yonder and near, then happily sail back to say, God stayed right by me every day. What do you want to be when you grow up? A lifeguard and discover new life forms. Whatever you decide to do, do it all for the glory of God. Yeah. New Year's Day starts out the year. I love when February's here and March, the first day of the spring, then Easter and the joy it brings. Soon May is here with pretty flowers. June is filled with wedding showers. In July, I'm out of school. In August, I swim at the pool. September means I'm back in class. October, leaves are changing fast. November, winter's on the way. And then the love born Christmas Day. Dear God, thank you the whole year through for watching everything I do. I know you always will be near to bless me every passing year. What is your favorite time of year? Halloween. Springtime. Probably Christmas. Christmas Eve. Hey, that's a great time. Remember to thank God all year long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God loves you. Yeah, yeah. He really loves you. Yeah, yeah. Do you believe it? Yeah, yeah. Then let's repeat it. Yeah, yeah. God loves you. Yeah, yeah. He really loves you. Yeah, yeah. Do you believe it? Yeah, yeah. Then let's repeat it. Yeah, yeah. God loved you yesterday. He loves you still tomorrow. His love won't fade away. So join our happy song. Oh, oh. God loves you. Yeah, yeah. He really loves you. Yeah, yeah. Do you believe it? Yeah, yeah. Then let's repeat it. Yeah, yeah. God loves you. Yeah, yeah. He really loves you. Yeah, yeah. Do you believe it? Yeah, yeah. Then let's repeat it. Everybody ready? I said, is everybody ready? Is everybody ready? Well, if everybody's ready, now's your chance. Get up and do the odd bar dance. Today, let's dance like a yo-yo. Well, you start up top. Then you let yourself drop. Then roll up again. As you spin and Go up and down and to and fro. You're a yo-yo, so yo-yo-yo. <laughs> it's a yo-yo dance. It's a yo-yo dance. It's a yo-yo.
yo-yo dance. It's a yo-yo dance. Well, you took a chance and did the yo-yo dance. We're done, so give yourself a hand. Now stand up and go out of here. Whoop! Why animals? Thank you, God, for yay pox. Thank you, God, for yay pox. And for yellow finned tuna. And for yellow finned tuna. Thanks for Yorkshire Terriers. Thanks for Yorkshire Terriers. And also yellow jackets. And also yellow jackets. Thank you, God, for yaks. Thank you, God, for yaks. For yellow bellied sap suckers. For yellow bellied sap suckers. God made all these animals. God made all these animals. And many, many others. Pray today for animals that are spelled with Y. A good night prayer. It's time to close your eyes, and you'll have a surprise. You'll yawn away the yesterday with dreamy yellow wise. Good night, good night. May angels in their flight Watch over you the whole night through Until the morning light Good night Goodbye, everybody. Sleep tight, and don't forget to say your prayers. Nighty-night. <laughs>